Hey guys. Um, okay, so I'm going to do two videos. Um, this one, I'm trying to like figure out how to do this. Oh, well, anyway, I'm going to do two videos. So I got my Sensi Club in today. So I'm going to film on that one. And then I'm also going to do the whiff box. But um, I did something different this month. So um, my Sensi Club is different. I've waited for this particular Scentsy Club for three months. I'm excited to see what's in it because I don't really remember. Um, I normally get my Whiff box in with my Scentsy Club, but um, I decided to skip May's Scentsy Club that has my Whiff box in it because it would be a lot of bars. <laughs> so, um, so the Scentsy Club I have today is my Scentsy Club from like the fall winter and I just ordered the Whiff box. So I actually got the Whiff box in last week and I've been waiting for a day that was good to film it. I was going to film it last night, but um, for you guys that are friends with me on Facebook, you'll know that I got a really um, nasty allergic reaction in my eyes. Um, this one is still a little bit puffy, but let me get this done because otherwise I'm never going to get it done. I need to get this put away. So without further ado, this is my Scentsy Club from, this is the one that I get quarterly. So I won't get this one again until August. Um, the reason I signed up this with box was to get fall winter scents that were being discontinued. And I didn't necessarily want to stockpile a whole bunch of fall winter smells that I didn't need throughout the summer. So I'm getting them quarterly. That way I get them, but it's not like overwhelming. And by the time August rolls around, I will know what is going to be in the next catalog um, for fall winter so I can take these off of my club if they're coming back or I can leave them on if they're not. So I plan on doing, because I have the two clubs, I plan on swapping them out. So this one will become my monthly subscription and my monthly subscription will become my quarterly subscription. And I'll put all like the summer smells on that one. So, um, in this box, this, so this one is just one just wax um I it's a big huge box of wax I'll show you this right here it's all just wax so I will show you let me just pull these all out real quick my husband always tells me that I have a whole bunch of um boxes are always showing up and I'm like I don't know what you're talking about there's no boxes <laughs> And this one was literally a, like a box within a box. So I guess he is correct that boxes just keep showing up. All right. Sorry. Almost done. And we're done. Okay. So some of these are not all winter. Um, let's start with the ones that are, though. Okay. Mm -hmm. You'll recognize some of these from the Thor. Okay, perfect. Let's do that one there. Doo -doo -doo. Perfect. Okay, so I have in this particular box, I have s nine, s nine, <laughs> nine bars that have been discontinued. And that's not all, but from the fall winter catalog, these nine bars were, disc were discontinued, may come back in the next fall catalog, um, may not. So that's why I have these. So I'll go through these really quick, um, just to kind of show you what I have. Um, <clears throat> first off is Cozy Cardigan. I love this smell. This was one that I didn't like when it first came out, but it has severely grown on me. Um, this one is actually a scent currently in the body line. Um, it's a really nice um, feminine musky smell. I love this smell. So there's that one. 
Next one is Ghostly Greetings. So this was a scent of the month, I believe in September. I love this one. Mm. This one is really heavy and musky smelling. So if you're not a big fan of heavy and musk, this one's probably not a good one for you, but I think this one is smells so good. There's that one. Um, I've hug in a mug. <clears throat> I actually get this one for a good friend of mine. She really likes this one. We swap out, we swap out. Oh my gosh, you can't talk. We swap out this one for Mocha Doodle because Mocha Doodle usually comes out now and Hug in a Mug comes out in the fall and winter. So um, I'm kind of collecting these bars for her. But this one is like literally just like a cup of hot chocolate. It's not that bad. It's not good. It's not that bad. It is good. Sorry. I shouldn't have filmed this at 1030 at night. Um, there's hazelnut in this too. So I love smelling this. I don't necessarily like warming it, but I do love smelling it in the, in the brick, in the clamshell. My goodness. Um, Arctic Kiss. This one also was a scent of the month in January. This one is such a nice, very like light um i'm trying to remember what was in this but it's like a very light um sweet smell super clean smelling i love that one that one's a great one this one's a good one i think would be good now it's not too heavy i would put this in my warmer now it smells so good um next up is dancing sugar plums now you'll know if you've watched my past Scentsy Club unboxings, this one was actually in my monthly club. I swapped it. <laughs> I put it in this one because I have a ton right now. I didn't need to keep getting it. Love this one. It's a super fruity with a little bit of cinnamon in it, <clears throat> which I found out. <laughs> um, it smells so good. This And the thing is, it's like smelling this now, I don't smell the cinnamon. But I know that I've smelled cinnamon in this before. And it was very confusing and I thought it was because it was um with another one that has cinnamon it has cinnamon but it doesn't smell super cinnamon to me uh, next up is jeweled pomegranate also a warmer or a scent of the month for November um, this one was a really nice one too this one was just um, straight up fruit smelling I don't think it's really spicy at all really really nice on that one that one's also a good one for now and I, I would put that on the warmer now too um this one very snowy spruce is my absolute have to have christmas smell i put this one in my warmer when my tree goes up so i wanted to get this in my club because i just know you never know what's going to come and what's not going to come back and i can't I can't get through Christmas without this one. So I had to get this one. Um, this one mixed with this one, Snow Kissed Cranberry, is fantastic. If you, um, if both of these come back, mix them together. Not necessarily in the same warmer, but like if you've got more than one warmer in an area, put these in at the same time. Oh, smells so good. Um, this one is my favorite berry fruit smell. It's just uh, super nice. It's like the cranberry is, makes it sweet, but then there's balsam in it. Oh, balsam is so good. So that's one of my favorites too. And then the last Christmassy fall one is I'm Snow Over It. I love this one. Um, this one is a good one for now too. It's like a sweet, clean smell. One of my favorites. That was a good one. Um, okay, so then the other two that aren't licensed or necessarily discontinued at this point, but I'm still getting them, are these two. Um, so this one is Red Pear and Pomegranate. This one was the scent of the month for, gosh, what month was that? February, I think. This one was really good. I really like this one. I still have a big <laughs> brick of this in my room, but I got this anyway. And then um, this was last month's Plumeria and Peach. Plumeria Peach, not and. Plumeria Peach. This one was so good. 
So I just had to get it. And I grabbed it before I could forget because I would. But anyway, that's, those are that. Okay. And then the other one in here is pineapple mint. This was from the life's a garden collection. I'm still debating on whether or not to add the apple basil one, because that one is also really good. But this one just, I don't know. I'm becoming more of a citrus person and this pineapple mint smell was just so perfect. It smells so good that I just, I had to get it. So I got it. It's discontinued. I'm still getting it. So that's worth it to me. <laughs> okay. So the next two things in here are, that's not true. Three things in here are licensed. So here's Ariel. Um, the Little Mermaid Kissed the Girl. Uh, True Love Awaits. And Disney's Fateful Friends. Faithful, not fateful. Gosh. Faithful Friends. I shouldn't do this one. I'm... I've also been on Benadryl all day long. <laughs> so it's not me either. Um, this scent, I smell this. I cannot. There's a... There's a weird memory that I can't really place or form when I smell this. It smells good. I can't place. It's not like it's not super sweet. It's not super floral. It's not. I don't know. I have to look at the notes on this one again because it's um, this one's really good. I don't know that I've warmed this one yet. I just put a new one in my warmer, which I'll show you in a second. But this one's really good. I'm excited to see what that one smells like warmed. Okay, this one I have put in my warmer. I, um, in the clamshell, I thought this would be really, really, really sweet. Because it does have like a perfumey smell to it. But on the warmer, this actually comes out really nice and soft. So I just need to get it for a little bit. Um, maybe get some for just to have... And then um, this one, Little Mermaid Kiss the Girl, is so nice. This one I think has apple in it. It smells like just a nice oceany smell. But so there's that one. So now, um, obviously, that's more than sixty dollars, and at sixty dollars, you get a half-priced item. And since I'm already getting the whiff box with my other <laughs> Sudsy Club, um, I decided to get a brick with this one as my half price. So. Um, I'm going to swap this out for the next one, but right now I'm getting black raspberry vanilla. So this is a brick. You can only get bricks right now in your club. Um, it's a select number of scents. I know obviously this one, um, Luna is another one. Um, Sunkiss Citrus, I think might be, I'll have to look and see. I can't remember them all off the top of my head. There's only a handful of them. Um, I'm hoping that Amazon rain might be one because I really want to get a brick of Luna and a brick of Amazon rain, but I love bricks. So, um, just to show you the size comparison, that's the bar and this is the brick. This is $24, but I'm getting it for 12. Um, it's, I would say it's about the equivalent. What did I say? Four of these. five. So a little bit more than five bars is the equivalent of a big brick. So at $24, that's a normal price is a steal, but then, um, you get a half price. It's even better. So this looks the last item in my club for now. Like I said, I'll probably switch them up. I'll probably switch my clubs around in July or August, but, um, We'll see with the new catalog coming out. This smells so good. I actually haven't ever warmed black raspberry vanilla, but I really, really like it. And like just about everything else that comes in. Um, okay, so that's my club. I want to show you guys. I don't know if I want to do it in this video. I'll do it then. Yeah, but in this video. Okay, so um, these are items that are going into my club, but I want to show you them real quick because they're kind of cool. So this, um, I don't remember if you guys saw my last club and I finished a collection of the Halloween town. I get to do another one because <laughs> I'm weird. 
<laughs> but this is for the um, Star Wars bars. So I'll show you these. So this came out on May the 4th. Um, I think these are still available. I didn't check beforehand, but the last time I checked, these were all still available. So, um, Star Wars collection, it was the Baby Yoda <clears throat> scent buddy, um, which I do believe is still available. The R2-D2 warmer, which I believe is still available and it came with bars. So there's a light side and a dark side. I just put in the dark side into my warmer now. Um, it's this really nice musky smell. Uh, it's interesting. I don't know if it's just because I know it's called the dark side, but it's like a heavier musky smell. And the light side is, so there's dark side, light side. Um, so this one's the one I put in now. So it's a heavier musky smell. There's um, definitely some spices in here. Uh, I have to, I'm gonna have to look at it up because I think It's got a, it's got a, a musky smell that I, I really like, and I just, I can't think of what it is. But anyway, so these are collectible, they change. So I got three of the red and three of the blue. So these are going in my club. I'm going to see if I can collect all four. We'll see. Um, so I got two of this one and I got a stormtrooper. So I got two of the four in this one. And then, um, the light side, so the light side smells a lot a lot fruitier, a lot sweeter, and a lot lighter. What does that smell like? Gosh, that reminds me of a smell. No, I can't place it. it. Smells really good. This one also has like musk to it too. It's really nice. So for this one, I got um, C3PO, Yoda, and Chewie and Han. And I can't remember what the fourth one was, but hey, I'm almost there to collecting this one. This one's really nice. I'm gonna put this one in the warmer next, probably. So that's the Star Wars collection, and there's one more collection I just got today that I wanna show you too. So this is the summer collection that's also still available. Um, there's four bars, and I only have a couple of bars in this one, and I, when you see the Wolf Box unboxing, you'll see why. So, um, the four scents are agave, blue agave and melon, uh, Fiji flower. There's mandarin and mango nectar. And I'm trying to remember what the other one was. Coconut, coconut daiquiri. <laughs> so I have, um, a friend of mine ordered a whole bunch of different things, so I'm going to kind of show you what, what we got, just kind of because you can see it. So there's all four scents are in bars, in bars, circles, and room sprays. Um, Fiji Flower smells really nice, very floral, but it's like in a clean way. Oh, that smells so good. Mm, that smells good. Um, Blue Agave and Melon is very melon smelling. That's very melon. Um, okay. So then the mandarin and mango nectar also comes in a cleaning bundle, which I'm super excited about. Uh, let me see what this one smells like. I know I have to pull the tab off. Oh, that smells good. It's like orange. It smells so good. I'm excited to use that. I'm almost out of my counter clean anyway, so it's good. And then um, Fiji Flower also comes in laundry. So you get this and you get two of these. So you get this and two of these. Um, I'm super excited to smell this because I think that Fiji Flower smells so good. If you guys have ever been thinking about doing the laundry, um, these are the good ones to start with. These are the washer whiffs. These are just um, scent crystals. There's no detergent or anything in them. Um, they come in this size and they come in a big tub. And um, I like them. I like, I like the whole system, but this is a good like putting your toe in the water to try it. These are great. Um, and then 
the other two scents, so blue agave and melon and coconut daiquiri. They come in sugar scrubs, which are in here, and bath soaks. So these are for the girl that um, shared shipping with me. These are for me because I love the sugar scrubs. Um, and then there was also a shave cream, which I didn't get, and little bracelets that come as well. But that's kind of basically it with the um, summer collection. Oh, there's also a fragrance flower in Fiji flower. But, um, so yeah, that's basically the summer collection. I think everything is still available. Um, if you guys have questions, let me know, but I will see you guys in the next box, next video with the Whiff Box unboxing.